Hello guys and welcome to the third tutorial of uh, our GTK scale button widget and today we are going to learn new things we are going to see new functions and uh, until now we learn how to create a new button how to set some adjustments, add icons and so on now it is time for us to move on with another functions and we are going to start with the value at uh, for the um, as the first one and says uh, gtk care button set value sets the current value of the scale if the value is outside the minimum or the maximum range value it will be clamped to fit inside them the scale button emits the value change signal as well we are going to talk about signals later about uh, clamping and so on uh, it should be clear for you what this means uh, and what happens uh, if you set a value which doesn't fit inside the minimum and the maximum this we will talk we'll talk uh, about them uh, on the gtk uh, adjustment uh, and gtk range widgets uh, tutorials if you don't uh, know or you're, or you're not sure just go back and check again gtk adjustment and gtk range okay so that being said i'm going to call this function and uh, i'm going to pass it right here so i'm going to call this one set uh, new value as you already know me i choose to be the default value 5 which was right in the middle so now we are going to change it with a new value and this new value i'm going to pass the jtk's button the first one it will be now 10 just to make something different from what we have now as you can see it's right up here this time it's not in the middle like it, it was and or uh, at the bottom it is right here so this means basically this this is what the gtk scale button set value does sets the value of your incrementer to a new value we decide to set it to 10 because 10 is the maximum value which we have it and uh, of course you can choose a new one you can set through your adjustment 100 and here you can put 70 for example 170 okay it will clamp just for sure and now now we have a big 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 value right here you cannot see but it is right there and uh, of course um, you need to know what kind of adjustment do you want to do okay if you choose uh, up and down bottom then you will see how much time takes to move from here up there this is the thing which you change when you choose uh, 100 as the maximum value of your scale or adjustment okay so that being said let us move to the next things uh, let us okay uh, if you want to get the value then um, you just need to print it to know how it works and if you need it later for some uh, other information then you know how to use it the value is and the value the actual value basically um, it should be 10 and of course our scale button I'm going to copy again this part right here and compile it and run it And as you can see the value is zero with all those decimal points as well 
settings goes to the adjustment if you want to to get the actual adjustment then you, you will um, save it into a GTK adjustment and later you can make some modification or you can set it to some other uh, widgets or whatever which kind of things you are willing to do for your application okay uh, the last three functions we're not going to talk about now it's just about if you need to get a git pop-up or you need to get uh, basically when you compile a program then you can get um, this information right here your pop-up or the plus and the minus widget or the minus button as well if you feel that you need it at the moment when you are working with you will see and you will use it me i'm not going to use it now because we are going to use it later in other video and uh, you will see how it's working but it's not important for you now to work with those three functions it is important for you just to know uh, how all other functions are working from here as well so that being said thank you guys for watching if you like it please subscribe share with your friends and neighbors and until next time see you guys